Hello everyone, I'm Single Dad and I am trying every plate for the first time. Uh, I've never done a meal plan before. I chose every plate for its introductory price of $1.79 per meal. Um, today we made the Super Smash Burgers with potato wedges. And it took me about 25-30 minutes and that was because I had to keep reading the instruction card. I do have a restaurant background so it would have been easier if they just would have said caramelize the onions you know toast the bun make potato wedges and make some smashed cheeseburgers but i wanted to do it to a t and this is what we got as you can see it looks pretty good i did add cheese to it it didn't come with cheese um my son likes cheeseburgers so i added cheese basically it's potato wedges and cheeseburgers we are going to give it a try my son's going to tell you what he thinks about it. What do you think it looks like so far? Do you think it looks good? Yeah, pretty good. The potato and the burger. What about the, where's the strips at? Where's the, the what? Chicken breast strips. No, today we're only having the Super Smash Burgers. So we just made the one meal. Um, like I said, this is every did plate. Some, did you add some barbecue sauce? We can add barbecue sauce. You can add what you want. But for the meantime, this is what you get. Burger okay. and potato wedges, and we we're going to try this, and then we're going to give you our thoughts, okay? So we're going to push pause right now. All right, guys, we're back, and it's Liam, and he's going to be trying the Super Smash Burgers from every plate, and he's going to give you his honest review. Go ahead, son, and tell us what you think. So he has caramelized onions, and I don't, so I'm just going to take a big bite of this. It's pretty good. So far, he likes it. What he was telling you was that with this um, meal kit, I am having a traditional recipe, which is caramelized onions and aioli sauce with the uh, potato wedges, and I have a little ketchup. He dipped his in barbecue sauce, and he said it was pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and give you my take on it. I'm going to take a bite right now and tell you what I think. And a bunch of onions just fell out of that. Wow, that is actually pretty tasty. The caramelized onions and the mayonnaise and garlic and paprika or chipotle sauce that they gave me that I whipped up really adds to the flavor. That, that is it is dang, it is dang pretty good. I didn't put any of that on my son's burger because I know he wouldn't eat it. So that's a big fat no. All right, well, um, we'll be back in just a moment with our final review of every plate super smash burgers and potato wedges he's trying the super smash burger yeah. with uh barbecue sauce and ketchup and ketchup and did you try potato wedges yet no we're gonna get to those in a minute okay go ahead pretty good pretty good how old are you He's going to be seven real soon, so as a seven-year-old, he says it's pretty good. Dad, you're going to get the review. All right, now he's trying the potato wedges. Dipped him in barbecue sauce, a little bit of ketchup. What do you think about those? Oh, really good. Nice. As a single dad, I will attest to this. Um, for him to try this stuff and say it's really good is pretty much a miracle. So I give every plate a big thumbs up for that. Because getting your 7 year old to try things is really, really, really hard. And when they actually do, they usually tend to like it. So for him to try those potato wedges the way they were and that burger the way it was and say it's really good, I am very impressed with that. All right, guys, I'm Adam. I'm the single dad. I'm here with my son, Liam, and this is our final review of our first time trying every plate. We did the smash burgers with the potato wedges. Um, on a scale from 1 to 10, Liam, 10 being the best, 1 being the worst, what would you rate this? I would do it probably at 8.5 out of 10. 8.5? I'm going to give it an 8.52. The instructions were a little bit difficult, difficult to follow while you're trying to cook everything but if you know what you're doing I can see it really being easy to pick up and sooner and later just being like um, very simple to make it took me about 25 to 30 minutes to make the two smash burgers the um, 
potato wedges. In all, I used a saucepan, a baking sheet, two bowls, a spatula, and a knife. That was it. So the dishes aren't very much. Uh, the food, oh, you get a lot of potato wedges. You get one burger. Yeah, I guess it was enough. Did you think it was enough? but it's true so and all i would say that every plate super smash burgers with potato wedges was a success I just got them. tomorrow we're going to be doing the jammin fig pork chops liam picked that out so we will give you a review on that and until then single dad says see you later